scroll down to the one for next fest and i did this and i was like how many wish lists do i have going into next fest and how many do i earn i did a splatter chart and what you'll see is it's still the case where if you go in with a lot of wish lists you get many more wish lists okay so you still want to do the last next fest before you launch because the more wish lists you have going in the more wish lists you're going to get and there's Lots of reasons why, and it's not just the guaranteed machine learning algorithm. There's other things that cause this. Um, but my bare recommendation, and, and there's no algorithm reason for this. It's just just looking at the trends, looking at the correlations. I know it's not causation, but I find that games that go in with 2,000 wish lists or more tend to do better on NextFest. Okay, again, I don't. Anytime I say a number, people overinterpret it. I'm just saying that it's like, in general. Games with 2,000 or more wish lists tend to do better. They just have more opportunity to kind of move up the charts, I guess.